villager even. Yeah, Wolf Wolf is a pain. Wolf is a pain against Zelda, especially in the situation where, and I know I've been saying this a lot, and it sounds like a dig against uh, Zero to None, but it really, it's more a point of the whole situation. And my program broke, so I'm gonna leave it to you while I fix that. Alrighty, so again, so to, to, to compare like these two like play styles right now, um, Z Zero to None kind of has like a switch. Like he knows when to like co use coverage for his uh for, with the Phantom. Know when to just use the get off me tool of neutral B. But and Stock Taker just outstanding neutral. Just th while it looks like he's just throwing out hitboxes, he's just covering two out of three options. But except for when you get traded like that. Yeah, you don't want to. You don't want to stay near Zelda's foot. Uh, but as I was saying, I think Wolf is one of Zelda's hardest matchups. It's definitely doable, as we're seeing here. But Wolf has a lot of tools that just make Zelda make Zelda's life miserable. He's got the laser, so he can poke at Phantom from a distance, unless you know how to displace. He's got Reflector, so even if you get the Phantom set up, he can still shoot it back at you. And in general, his game plan is get in your face and don't go away, which a bad Zelda will crumble under that. Yeah, definitely sounds like you need to have a cool head to play against to play as Zelda and against Zelda because you're getting hit by a lot of these projectiles, a lot of moves that like have I don't want to say questionable, but like nice hit boxes. Um, like I can feel the air quotes behind that one. Um, nice, nice when they sweet spot. <laughs> yeah, but here comes the, so like got to keep a cool head with that one. Um, right now, momentum and the ball is in Zero Nun's court. Now, that could be kill because of rage. No, not yet. Battles at ledge, 100%. Tries to uh, hit him with the sweeps. Nothing. Fourth throw has the least uh, knockback growth, so that's going to be the longest to kill. At this yeah. point, uh, Zero Nun would probably want to go for an up throw. Yeah, especially now at 166. I think he was doing that just to build more damage and not to uh, stale out the up throw. He wasn't confident. He wasn't sure. That too. All right, so, so now there you go. See? There's your up throw. There's the up throw. Now 13% on a on a zero to none. Stock taker has a, bi a big mountain to climb here, um, and it's not gonna it's not gonna help with get with it's gonna start with getting out of this disadvantage. If he wants to get out of this here, ah, Phantom not being a friend friend to him. And let's see, okay, zero to none kind of swinging a lot swinging around right now, and he's kind of getting clipped a lot by just stock takers just. Neutral with the na with nares and aerials. Stock has fought against so many Zeldas at this point. He knows that Zelda's biggest tools, the the sweet spots and Phantom. Mm -hmm. He knows how to get around them. Like yeah, sometimes he just uh, trips up and falls into it because Phantom is still tricky. But yep, he's avoiding it spectacularly and giving Zelda just a difficult, difficult time. Oh, okay. Managed to snap to ledge. Here again. Look, look at the patience, but that's not gonna kill. That's it will kill. That's an F smasher, baby. Game one going to zero to done. All right, so this is winner's finals, folks. So that means it's gonna be three out of five, which is definitely really good for Stock Taker. He has a couple more games. He has one more game to experiment. He could start with the wolf. He could stay. He could stick with the wolf, or he can take uh, take out that fifth character, that fifth main that I'm just curious about. All right, let's. We're going. It seems that we're running it right back, and we are, and we're going to, and we're and he's sticking with the wolf. I don't know how I feel about this. I mean, out of all Stock Taker's characters, matchup-wise, I think Wolf is the best, aside from maybe Palutena. Well, it's a character that he's very comfortable with. Like sometimes, sometimes you know, you feel like you you could have just done something different, and and yeah, Stock Taker wasn't playing. He didn't. He pl it was like he wasn't warmed up to his wolf. Which the last uh, game he did play, uh, the last card he played on stream for a set was with Palatena against uh, Soul Arts' she, uh, Shulk. So I do, I definitely see that he needs that first game to just warm up his wolf right back. So he has a lot of uh, leeway to go for it. All right, Oos, forward throw, trying to get, trying to get something started. See, look at this. Like the neutral is actually like swinging back into. Okay, never mind. Is swinging back into his favor, so there's the dash attack, and again, so see what I mean? That Wolf's uh, Wolf is actually uh, the Wolf is actually working out to a degree. Momentum is swinging in Stock Taker's favor here. He <laughs> tried to read the roll from Ledge and try to go with the Almighty push, but but uh, Zero not 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 having any of it. 
So Stock is going to just camp back, try to wait for something to get started. Shoots the laser, interrupts the Phantom. And oh, wow, just slight delay to keep away from the F smash. And okay, down tilt. Okay. Gets hit with the bayonet, 106%. Lightning Leg gonna take it here. 106% on zero to none though. Stock Taker managed to get something started. Wow, there's the almighty push. He got it started. Yeah. Okay, so let's see. Now we gotta see, this isn't impossible for uh, zero to none to bring back, but he's gotta to to play really smart. Yeah. And I don't like all the grabs he's going for. Yeah, he's getting antsy. And that's and that's where Stock is uh, actually getting a lot of his uh, a lot of like this percentage from this loose percentage from just like these uh, whipped grabs. He's kind of just like he's just kind of swinging and he's getting punished. Uh, all, look at how many like dash attacks he's throwing like the last 20 seconds and how many times Stock is just punished with like a laser or like a dash attack or something. All right. Now here's the because here's the thing with the grab. Your standing grab with Zelda is frame 10. So you get a lot of combo potential off of it, and you can convert it into kills, you can convert it into combos, you can convert it into all the damage you want, but you're in such a risky position even going for it. Uh, I don't unless like... you know you're going to grab it. Yeah. All right. Oh, my God. Back throw, not going to kill just yet. That might have killed at the ledge, but we'll see after uh, stock builds up a little bit more percentage here. F-Tilt definitely going to kill at the ledge, though. I did not think he was going to be able to set a Phantom there. Oh. All right, so he's now trying to get some cheese with the uh, with, with, an F, with an F smash through it. But, yeah, going to back throw. But now it's staled. It's not going to work as much. 162, zero to none. Managed to hold on to this last stock. He's got, he's trying to cl clear out this game, too, and make sure he stops even less. Make now sure one, stock has even less of momentum. One thing I want to point out, stock taker is at death percent right now. Yeah, I know. One Pharaohs could change this entire thing around. One whiff on shield, and we're going to game three with 2-0. Yes. All right, but 193%. One, one yeah. That's going to take it. All right. Stock Taker almost going on his own percent there. Managed to, cl managing to grab it out there. A little bit of a heart, a little bit of a heart pounder, but we're going to game three. Well, there's um, so many moves that are safe on shield, so. We're running it back. All right, all right. Marty, we have to go back. Okay. So we we'll one more time. All right, so let's see how this one's going to going to turn out here. Because uh, zero to none, still sticking to Zelda. Um, Anyone feeling some deja vu right now? And and stock taker actually try and stock taker again just trying to like just build his momentum again with uh with his wolf and it's definitely warmed up to like the to the degree it needed to <laughs> and there's some of those tech chases or at least the coverage like the, the tech coverage right there oh it tells the phantom bye bye and zero not, not getting a big punish off of that. Okay. Stock's just controlling the pace. It's a lot harder for Zelda to get back from that. Yeah. That's definitely like some of the parts where like Zelda struggles is that once she's in dis disadvantage, it's pretty hard for her to come back because if she got charged Phantom, like she can get shot, <laughs> especially with a projectile like with like wolves. And there are ways to mitigate it, but Zero to None hasn't been able to show us it yet. Yeah. All right, again, like, look at, like, these, like, like stock just, like, uh, safely uh, not hitting the shield with back air. And, oh, no, the second hit of f not going to take it, but there we go. He tries again. 98% on stock, so sweet shit music. Definitely going to take another, is definitely going to have him lose his first stock in game three. And, all right, no punishes also from, like, a lot of these, like, whiffed hitboxes from, uh, from stock. One thing that Stock's really taking advantage of is knowing when ZTN's going to hit the, uh, as I call it, the panic button, also known as neutral beat. Yeah. Uh, and just punishing on it. And this time, and I know ZTN has been doing a lot of like up smashes at ledge. This time he actually gets it and is going to take out take out Jared's uh, first stock of game three. But it's not over yet. And now, and again, like straight off the Angel platform, 
Stock Taker is has the momentum. He he's bullying ZTN right now. I uh, try to clip him with the up smash, but nope, nothing yet. Trying to set a phantom, but stock's right there. Yeah, he's right there, with ready with the ready with the stop it. Okay, F tilt, one forty two percent. Good teleport. Stock didn't see that coming. All right, dash attack not going to take it yet. One fifty three percent on the playing field for uh, for ZTN and F tilt. That's going to take it for sure. Show me. 40% coming, 40% on Stock Taker. This ZTN has almost a full stock, uh, full stock advantage to kill, but never mind. We're that, good. That is a complete it's trap right there. So we're even. We're even right now. Stock taking his time to collect himself, and there's the neutral B. But <laughs> Stock Taker definitely getting started. And he, and one thing I'm noticing too is that uh, ZTN is trying to fish for uh, Stock to go a little over aggressive. Uh, with the up airs through the ledge and stock just hanging back, just waiting for just uh, ZTN to make it back, make it back to ledge and just attack the, and read the proper option there. I mean, the nice thing about doing the uh, up air under the ledge is you're relatively safe. If you're doing that, you can't really get punished for doing it. So oh, it's of at course. least a nice pressure tool. It's a nice pressure tool and stock. And the thing is that stock is again not falling for it. He's not getting hit by it as much. Uh oh, gets caught swinging. Use great angle to make it back to the ledge. Hits the F smash. Oh, that's gonna and take it. Inspire. Yeah. Boom. Yep. The full. Yeah. No. That's that's definitely gonna take it. Right. Meta Knight, hang on. No, he went to Palatetta. Okay. That makes more sense. Time for Zelda against, uh, what do we call her? Call her Zelda? Uh, Wheel of Zelda. Zelda Wheel, got it. Okay, gets a down throw Good here. Grab, jab lock. But just knocks him off the platform. I do like the up air. If Stock was still on the platform, that would have been a beautiful uh, follow up. Oh, yeah. F Smash, not going to take it just yet. Okay. Back throw off stage here. 70% on, on ZTN and gets the F tilt. Man, that, that is such a long hitbox there. Could use the reflector to negate explosive flare. Mm -hmm. Forward throw. Ooh, oh, that's no good. Gotta go to ledge. Oh, well, now he is. Dash attack, 132%. So I don't know. I don't know what's gonna kill. I don't know what's gonna kill off off of Palu for now. Maybe, um, maybe another dash attack. No, the dash attack can kill. Back air can kill. Up air, probably near knowing how Palu is. Up smash. Back throw and let back throw and ledge. But like I've said before, stock is also at a dangerous percent. Going for the dumb, uh, the dumb pharaohs works far more often than you think. Yeah. And just dash attacks right through that, right through the phantom here. Stock taker. Managing to even it up right now. Could use the edge cancel by uh, stock. Okay, a couple of nairs. Tries to get the uh, down air to get something started here. Okay. Oh, it doesn't get the second nair out of it. All right. <laughs> Interesting read there. F smash 74% on stock on stock taker. He's off stage. Yeah, he's neutral get upping a lot, and it's and that's what's and that's what ZTN's uh, capitalizing on with those F smashes with the up it, with the up smashes too at ledge. All right. Well, a couple of times, 
more than a couple times, the fan has also been set up, so you're really stuck in a bad situation because if you do a get up attack or a jump off ledge, you're gonna get hit by Phantom. If you try and drop down, you're gonna get hit by Phantom. And even a roll, you're gonna get pushed by Phantom into the F smash, which is waiting for you on the other side. All right, the back are not gonna kill just yet. One set, 148 on uh, on ZTN, all right. Yep, I kind of expected something like that I was gonna take it. Drum set to avoid the Din's fire. Phantom covering the the neutral get up and, and roll from ledge. Air dodging away, 161%. Whoa, I thought Stock got the grab there. And ZTN managed to grab it, and Phantom. that was just Trap City there. With that, we got ZTN, the Zelda, on winner's side of Grand Finals. Let's get on. Now with that, we're going to go to a quick uh, We're going for break. an ad break? We're going to make a quick ad break, so don't mind that. I look clearly different. Don't mind my ventriloquism. You know what this is, bro? What is that? I, I don't know what that is. I'm not really sure, and to be quite honest with you, I don't really want to have it. Well, I'm not familiar with this. I, I, don't, know I, this I don't have a lot of those, you know? Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. I ain't about this. this you take me. it, bro. I don't need it. You, you need can it. hold this.
course.